Hey guys, welcome to today's video of Bring Me the Horizon Lost. I got deja vu for a second. So like I've said in my previous reaction of their song Strangers, at that time I stopped listening to them after That Despair came out. And then after hearing Strangers, obviously I was like, that's an amazing song. So then I went back and I listened to everything I've missed. And I love every single song that they've put out, just in general. So I have pretty high hopes for that song as well. I am a fan. I just took a little break, but Strangers brought me back. So let's see how I feel about Lost. And let's just jump straight into it. And that is Bring Me to Horizon Lost. No, no, he's alive! The, the blood is a, a little bright because I recently saw like actual blood and I was like, damn, blood is dark as hell. And this is kind of light. This is kind of bright for me. But I just want to say that that eyeball scene reminded me of a scene from a movie called The Faculty. I think it was from 1999. It's probably one of my favorite movies. I've seen that movie like 17 times. That was funny. I like it. Uh, but the CGI is so bad. Look at that throat. That's just so bad. But let's not judge. Let's watch the whole video. Oh, he left his scalp. Why did they have to show this now? I'm gonna be pausing a lot. I'm sorry guys, but if that's something that you don't like, don't watch this video because how can I how can I not pause here? Hold on. I'm sorry, but this sounds to me like My Chemical Romance, that chorus specifically. It reminded me of I'm Not Okay, and I'm only saying this song because I know five MCR songs, and that's one of them. And it just gave me that I'm Not Okay vibes chorus right here. Why does my quality drop, dude?
this way Is that a different song at the end? Or was that a reminiscence of the other? Okay, hold on. I will tell you. It does give me so much MCR vibes, especially like this part. I mean, I've already told you that the chorus gives me MCR vibes, but like here where the chorus is stripped down and silent. <laughs> If you don't think of, of that other part, I'm not okay by MCR, I don't know, that's what I'm thinking of. That entire chorus just gave me that vibe, but enough about that. Ollie shouldn't have done that song with MGK, this is what happened. No, but I'm kidding. I actually really like the song. It's got these pop punk emo vibes, which is something that I've never heard from Bring Me The Horizon, but apparently they can do it all, so there's that. But the breakdown was something very interesting. It's definitely something I've never heard of. It was kind of like a hyper pop breakdown and it was just so chuggy and just perfectly executed. I really like that. That kind of changes the way a breakdown could sound, I feel like. The whole song wasn't something that we haven't heard of before. It's something that we haven't heard of from Bring Me The Horizon, but not something we haven't heard of in general. I feel like that's mid-2000s emo slash pop punk, but they just sort of added that twist to it, that modern twist, hyper pop sound that they've been doing with their previous songs, which I really like. And... Maybe that's kind of like a new genre. I don't know. I don't know what they're doing, but I really like it. Also, that scene right here. I, I love the video. I just want to say, of course, the effects are kind of cheap. I mean, if you compare that to Falling in Reverse's video they put out, it's like, I mean, come on, <laughs> you know. But I like the, the idea of it. The idea was really good. And this scene, this right here. Wasn't that uh, someone from, I just, I thought of the show The Boys and there was the, that girl that she, was it the girl that had those superpowers where she would like look at people and they would just like. <laughs> but it just reminded me of The Boys. Also, Falling in Reverse's video, I don't know, I probably didn't say it when I reacted to the video, but that scene where he's like shooting lasers out of his eyes, that was that guy from The Boys, the, the, the main character, Homelander. <laughs> Overall, I like the song. It's different than Strangers, but it's in a good way. I, I love emo and pop punk, so I feel like this song is a little bit up my alley more. I feel like this song is a little bit more up my alley. I'm really curious. I feel like I'm definitely gonna like this album that I put out. I mean, the first two songs are amazing, very different, but yet still amazing. And like I said, I feel like they can Bring Me The Horizon can execute any type of sound at this point and it would always sound top tier. It's just the way it is. But what do you guys think about the song? Do you like it? Do you like more of the other direction they went in with Strangers? Let me know in the comments and uh, thank you for watching. Subscribe for more.